and lazy. Okay. When am I going to have a family? I mean, someone I can call daddy and mommy. Dora, listen and listen good, okay? Each and every one of you will definitely have a family who to call mom and dad, okay? The only thing you have to do for yourself, when I mean that, the only good thing you have to do for yourself is to work hard and pray hard as well. Definitely, God will definitely hear you and you will have a family. I can't wait for that day. It's all I ever wanted. Really? Yes! A new home filled with joy and laughter. Mm, then you have to pray hard, okay? Sure. Come here. That's my girl. Pablo, what is it? Mili, I don't want you. I the hungry you. Better hungry the mama me you. What is this saying? Mom, it means he's hungry. <sighs> but you gave them breakfast. Yes, mom. I did. But Pablo is never ever satisfied with every food they give him in this house. Mm. <sighs> Pablo, it's not yet not Eh? Okay, don't worry. She will soon come and give you people food, eh? So go to your room. Nah, he's still not poor. He's still not poor. She will come and give you food, eh? Uh, she will come and give you lunch. Good. This girl will keep so good. He's safe at all. <laughs> no. I'm tired of Pablo. Pablo keeps on amazing me in this house. I should not ah. finish our food. As in eh? It's okay. So, don't worry. Go and make, give them lunch. Yes. So, what would they eat? What do you think? Mm, I don't know. Why don't we make use of the roster? I think it's swallow. Yeah, this is after the shit swallow. We can go tonight. It's okay. I'm going to attend to them. Uh, <laughs> yes. Okay, okay. We've completed already. Pending when our time will come. And your husband consented to it? Yes, of course. Wait a minute. Who instigated this whole idea? If I may ask. Who else? But me. Oh. That's my idea. I thought as much. But then, girl, I think you're just too young to be thinking in that line. Why don't you hold on? Your child will come at the appropriate time. Of course, girl. I know that. I know what I am doing. I'm an adult. You don't have to preach to me about that. I know my time will come. Okay? You know what, girl? Let's forget about this, okay? Mm -hmm. So how was your Dubai trip? <laughs> Fantastic. I know. As always. <laughs> uh, wait a second. Aren't you going to offer me something to eat? Oh, calm down. We've not finished talking. I know you're hungry. I'm famished. I need to eat something. Calm down. Okay. So let's go to the dining and eat. Food oh, dining. I can eat here. Baby, I'm hungry. Please go and bring food. If you want to eat here, stop treating me like a beast. You don't care to my ass to See, I'm your food. friend, though. You Stop treating me like a visitor. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, we have a lot of talking to do. Yeah, I do. Oh, my girl. <laughs> so, you mean you made this meal yourself? girl i'm a professional cook you should know that by now of course <laughs> but did you see any milk? no i didn't i did it myself thank <laughs> you you're welcome yeah so when is your husband coming back i'd love to meet him he will very soon mm -hmm. i hope i meet him before i leave of course. you will <laughs> you'll wait 
Okay. Girl, I have things to do. Ah, you don't have things to do. <laughs> After eating my food, you want to leave. No, you will wait and see him. Okay. <laughs> Maybe when oh, I you gave to... all the way from Dubai to eat my uh, uh, bangas. Gary. <laughs> Probably when I'm on the second plate, you meet me, I'm sure. All the way from Dubai, you can't eat a Just look at what you're doing to me, but I enjoy the food. Though. Just look at my slave queen. Slave mama eating guys. All the way from Dubai. Boy, it's so nice. This is Nick Branga. It's really Aww, nice. Oh, you can say that again, baby. Thank you. Slave queen. My child, don't cry no more. You just say a prayer and hope for the best, and God will see it true. He knows your innocence, He sees your pain. Don't be afraid to shine Cause you are a star Good day mom, my name is Dorothy and I'm in grade 4 And I can read, draw and tell stories very well I'm fun to be with Aww, that's a lovely child <laughs> Now we will your furnish Eh? But now me, the Pablos. AKA Papa Bibus. AKB, I know sir, BBB grandma. AKC, life must be water. Okay, mm -hmm. Who don't know me? I don't know what black and white television. I feel make you laugh. Be strong, <laughs> <laughs> It's very funny. Yeah, but well, I think we should see the management first. Okay. Come on, guys. You're welcome once again, Mr. and Mrs. Ben. Thank you, Thank you. I've heard all you said, and uh, I have a question for you. You know, you two are still young couples, and you're likely to have your own children. So why do you want to adopt? Actually, Ma, it's all my wife's idea. She needs someone to be with her at home when I'm not around. Someone to keep her company. And secondly, I actually wanted it so that I would learn how to train a child, pending when my time will come. Trust him. Don't worry, ma'am. We will take proper care of her. We will give her the best of life. <laughs> exactly. It's okay. So, what gender of a child are you looking at? And what is the age range? Yeah. Uh, we will go with a girl now. Yes, a girl. Between the range of um, 8 to 10 years. That will be a problem. We have lovely girls in the orphanage that you like. Mm -hmm. That isn't a problem. So can we and see them? Yes. After you, ma'am. <laughs> So, person of a great person again, Abby? Not in that manner. Which, who, oh yeah, which manner again? Eh? Who manner? Abby? Oh, no. Abby, delete. Comedy himself. 
Please, you have lovely children here, beautiful ones, so you can make a choice, huh? Mm. <laughs> Hello. 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 A picture of the kind of mom I would love to have. Isn't she beautiful? <laughs> oh, yes, my baby, she is beautiful. Can I see? Oh, <laughs> she's so beautiful. Oh, she's beautiful. You want to make it with the artist. Okay. Yes. And the picture of the kind of mom I would love to have looks like you. <laughs> Take a look at her. She's beautiful, our sweetheart. Yes, Dorothy is one of the most brilliant kids that we have here. She's so well behaved too. Mm -hmm. So, um, Dorothy, would you love to join my family? Sure! <laughs> oh, my darling, my darling. You're welcome, baby doll. Thank you. You'd like to live with them, wouldn't you? Yes. I'm loving her already. Okay. It's okay. So it's settled then. Okay. Come, let's go sign the papers. Okay, children. All right, children. Enjoy yourselves then. Eh? Bye. 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 Oh, yeah. think about Dorothy? You know, she's smart, intelligent, yeah. and beautiful. <laughs> yeah. I really I'm, love her. I'm sure she will make um, a good daughter. Yeah, yeah, sure. And I promise to love her with all my heart. Oh, I know you're happy. <laughs> <laughs> I know. <laughs> I know. Thank you, honey. Thank you so much you're for welcome. making my day. You're welcome. Anything for you. Yeah. <laughs> I know she's happy. Yeah, she's happy. Do you want to, baby? Yes, mom. And you... so we're going home. Yes. <laughs> You're going to love your new home? Yes, I will. So glad to have you. Yeah. Okay. Mm. Oof. <clears throat> Okay, we're here. Mom. Yes. I will miss Dora so much. I mean, she's one of my favorite children in this orphanage room and also in classroom. Elizabeth, my child, you're right. You're so right. I'll miss her so much too. Dorothy is one of the most well-behaved children in this our home. I am so going to miss her. Hmm. Oh, what do we do? I'm sure she will have a good life out there. They will treat her well. But mom, those corporates, they're still young, they're not old. So why are they in a hurry? to adopt a child. Elizabeth, my dear. Some people come to adopt children for the love of it. Even couples that have children also come here to adopt a child. 
it's, it's a way of, you know, giving back to the society. More like a humanitarian gesture. Kind of giving back to the society. They do it because they want to do it. So there's nothing wrong with it, okay? Do you think so, Mom? My dear daughter, I don't just think so. I know so. Hmm? Ah, these kids, they are so restless. Take the uh, carton of biscuits that they brought okay. and share to the kids, okay? Okay, Mom. Obstacles, hoping for the best, expecting the worst. Oh, yeah. And every single day, and every single night, I'm praying. Oh. Okay, welcome. How are you? Nice. You're welcome to your new home. Thank you so much. I'm so glad. Aww. We are we're also glad to have you. Yeah. Okay? Okay. And honey, please take Dorothy to our room. Of course. And of please course. make her feel comfortable. Aww. My little puppy. Mm -hmm. Let me take it to your room, okay? Okay, mom. My baby. My baby. Oh. Wow. Welcome home. Welcome home. This room is so beautiful. Really? Yes, mom. You love it? Yes, mom. You I love do. it? Oh, of course, I know you love it, my baby. <laughs> mm -hmm. I know you love it. So, you know what? Just feel relaxed, okay? This yeah. is your home soon. Mm -hmm. Yes. Fresh enough. I look beautiful. For me. For your mommy. <laughs> mm -hmm. I love you. I love you too. I love you too, baby. Take care. I'll see you later. Okay. Refreshing up. Hmm? My smart baby. All right. Enjoy yourself. Wow. This room is so beautiful. He knows your, your innocence. innocence. He, he knows, 
kisses your pain Don't be afraid to shine Cause you are a star Oh, you are a star You are a star Mom, look at this! I scored good grades! Yes, Mom! My princess. 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 My Yes. I love you! <laughs> You're the first mom in the world! Oh. You're welcome, honey. So let's go in now, okay? Okay, mom. Let's go. And it's your favorite meal! Thank you! Don't be afraid to shine Cause you are a star Whoa! You are a star. You are a star. Dad! Dad, I don't know what is wrong with mom. What is it? She's trained up. She's trained up? Please, Dad. Come down, she goes down and move. How are you feeling now? And then talk to me. You know I don't like seeing you like this. I'm feeling so weak. And I feel like Trey now. I don't know what's wrong with me. I don't know. Do you think we should go see the doctor? Yeah. Okay, just um Dorothy. Let me change up or something. Test result conducted in your wife. I am pleased to announce to you that your wife is six weeks pregnant. <laughs> Doctor, are you serious? I'm very serious. This is your test result. You can have a look. For real? For real. <laughs> you can have a look. Congratulations. Mm -hmm. Only the Lord has done it. I told you. I'm so happy for you. Mm -hmm. Doctor, thank you so much. Thank you, Doctor. You're welcome. Thank you so much. Thank you. Congratulations, Mother. Wow. Oh, you're so happy. Oh, thank you, Jim. I'm so happy for you. Thank God. I told you. Yeah. So happy. Doctor, I think we should be going now. Yes. Drive safe. Don't forget to come back to Nata when it is time. Thank you, Doctor. It's alright. Thank you. I, I do appreciate it. It's right. Thank it's you right. so much, Doctor. Have a nice day. Yeah. Bye. Bye. Take it easy. Bye. Happy couple. <laughs> the joy of parenthood. Ah, why is it? No sneezy! I was really super excited when I heard the good news. Mm -hmm. 
<laughs> Congratulations once again, Mr. Ben. <laughs> Thank you, Stella. You're welcome. <laughs> what a minute. <laughs> Is someone not forgetting something? What is it, honey? <laughs> the person I'm talking about knows herself. Oh. And she knows what to do. <laughs> You're so naughty. <laughs> okay, congratulations. Thank you, thank you so much. Um, we did it together. My husband and I. <laughs> Absolutely. See, my wife has been such a courageous woman. Mm. My joy of inestimable value. <laughs> Honey, let me tell you, you are the very reason why I have it. Really? Oh, thank you, baby. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you, darling. <laughs> so is getting jealous here, yeah, seriously. Okay. That's by the way. Don't you guys think we should celebrate this? Oh, yes. Um, so tell me, what's your favorite? Like, what's the brand? We have champagne, we have wine. What do you want? I'll go with wine. Oh, okay, just, um, I think you guys should just hold on. Yes, honey. Let me get a bottle of champagne. Sure. Okay. Okay? Thank you. One minute. Hmm. Soon to be dead. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so happy for you guys. Thank you. Thank you. I'm so happy. It's quite exciting. So it's a flutter. <laughs> Oh, I'm so happy to see you, Good morning. Good morning, girl. Wake up. Get up, it's morning. Good morning. Dad, I'm here. Yes, I'm here. Wake up, it's morning. Dad, what do you do? It's Saturday. No school. Yes, today is Saturday. That's why you have to do all the chores in the house. As you can see, I'm no longer fit to do that because I do not want to risk the health of my precious jewel. So you have to do as I say, okay? But honey, what do you want Dorothy to do? Everything. Everything? Yes. We can simply get someone to do that. Dorothy is still too young to handle house chores. Who? Hello? She's too young, at her age. There's no need for that. She has to do everything just like I said. Stand up. Hallelujah, stand up! Uh -uh. Don't be lazy. Stand up and go and do. I have to go and clean, mop, mop everywhere. All the kitchen, I want everything to be sparkling today. Stand up, stand up. But what? You don't know how to clean? Look, I want to clean everywhere. Walk everywhere, walk everywhere to be sparkling today. Okay? Okay? That's a machine. It's strong, it's strong. Child of nobody can be somebody. Remember, only God has a final say. Oh, oh, oh. oh, oh. Hello, Bella. Dorothy. Bella. Dorothy.
little girl is really suffering. I wonder when Bella will treat her right. I really wonder. Hello. Hi. Dorothy, how are you? I'm doing great. Sorry I didn't see you walking. I was busy with work. It's okay. Um, where is your mom and dad? They've gone for Antonanto. Oh, 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 okay. Um, I tried calling your mom already, but it wasn't connecting, so I thought I should drop by and say hello. Sorry about that. It's okay. Oh, does she know you're coming? Um, not really, but I can always come back. Perhaps when they are around. Okay, Auntie. It's alright. Take care of yourself, okay? I will. Alright. Um, let your mom know I came, okay? Okay. Uh -huh. Um, dear Auntie. Um, I don't have much right now. I want you to. No, thank you, Auntie. I'm fine. Why? Nothing. It's okay. I'm fine. Thank you. <laughs> Keep it. No, I'm fine. I won't tell you, mommy. I appreciate it. Thank you. Okay. If you insist. I'm telling you what I can. Okay. Bye. Talking about the word. Right. So I want you all to know this. Do you know that God loves you? Yes, absolutely. Do you know that you're beautifully and wonderfully made by Him? Yes, absolutely. They're beautifully and wonderfully made by Him. Wait, they ask. Why would I ever ask you by now? Pablo, what's you? Why are you talking to Auntie Lizzie like that? Who follow you talk? When you delete, that would have also again. Absolutely, that's my Oh my love, that's good, it's fine. So listen, I want you all to know this, alright? No matter the circumstances, the challenges you're facing, his banner over you is love. His banner over you is love. That's good. So I want you to know that God really loves you from the day of conception, okay? So no matter the challenges, no matter how hard it is, always pray hard, definitely there will be an intervention, okay? Yes. Success! So since I'm teaching, you're still eating. Sorry, Auntie Lucy. I love you. Aww. <laughs> it's fine, okay? Now clap for yourself. I can't wait to have my baby. I know my baby is going to be beautiful. Yeah, she will be beautiful. Like the morning rose. Ah, my baby. Mom. I'm famished. I love to take breakfast cereal. Oh, you're famished. You will love to take breakfast. What? What do you say? Cereal. Cereal. Did you see cereal up ahead? Is it eating cereal? My friend, will you get it before I change my mind? Now! Okay, mom. But can I add two spoons of milk? Oh. If you like, add ten. That's none of my business. Can't you allow me to have peace? Huh? You don't want to give me peace. My friend, get out. Now, at 10. Oh, what's this? Oh, I will have to take the breakfast, Sarah. Excuse my joy. My baby. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, 
what is okay. Dad, you look like mom. <laughs> really? You like? Mm. Yes. Mm. <laughs> yeah, what is okay? Let me see my face. No, Dad, I'm not drunk. Can come true. Yes, Doverty, it is okay. I'm not done. What is this, Doverty? <laughs> You're looking cute. Come on, let me call you. No, Dad, you look like mom. <laughs> oh, I need to go and wash my face now. <laughs> no, Dad, you look like mom. You're beautiful. Don't clean it. Let me add. Abdul! Abdul! Sir, check out the gates. I don't come. Here. Welcome. Why are you looking like a rat that's about to be fried? We're just having fun time. With my makeup? Fun time? Fun time with my makeup? Huh? Having fun time with my makeup? Do you know how much this makeup costs? Huh? You allow this little girl to mess you up? Have you seen your face? You're looking like a rat that is about to be fried. Huh? You allow this small girl to mess you up. Look at my makeup. I spent a lot in getting there. And you, you have no fear to carry my makeup and start doing this rubbish you're doing. Huh? You have no fear to use my makeup to do rubbish, to do as you like. If I sell you and the entire orphanage home, it's not even enough to buy one of my makeup. Huh? Are you out of your mind? You're, you're, taking it too, you're, you're taking it too far. Taking it too far how? Huh? You allow this girl to mess you up. Looking like a retired homosexual. Have you seen your face? <laughs> you're, you're taking it too far. Stop, stop it! Ah. Stop. Will you stop? Will you, will you, will you stop this? Take my makeup! Will you, will you, will you, what, 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 what's the name of this? your so-called daughter. Please! Please take, take it easy now. You don't understand. Every time. Hmm? I give my trouble every time. This girl has no fear. Don't blame me. It's your own fault. Everybody should just avoid me in this house. You should avoid me. Avoid me! I knew it. I knew I was dreaming. And one day I will wake up. Dorothy, where are you? Dorothy, I'm here. Where are you? Dorothy, please don't cry. Dad, why? Why? I'm sorry. Please forgive your mom. I am sure it is the pregnancy your mom. 
that why can adults be so pure as kids? Children are the innocent and thus always suffers. When adults make mistakes, they abandon the children. When adults are insured, they put it on the children. And when adults are irresponsible, the children get neglected. Yet, the children always forgive and don't hold grudges. Children are so pure at heart that mom hates me now. No, she doesn't. Dad, we're meant to know that to be a family doesn't require blood, but require love. Yes, and I love you. That is why I'm here for you. You can always confide in me. So children, someday, every one of you here is going to have a daddy and a mom. Is that all right? Yes, please. Hello? Okay, please. Okay. Yeah, I'm listening. Aren't you lazy? Yes, it's good. But can they still love us and see us as a family? Why did you ask such question? <laughs> Better ask. Hence, we're not a biological lot. Neither are they our biological parents. Okay, yes, you're right, Dora. But they can still love you as a family, you know? But how is that possible? Um, listen, Dora. You see, in the orphanage home, okay, we make the world to believe that family doesn't just require blood, it also requires love. Children too are also given birth by heart. Listen, you see, that's why my mom loves each and every one of you here. And that's why we are all living as family today and ready to give birth by heart. Okay? Okay, I, I pray I'm conceived in a good heart. Okay now, so it's time for us to eat. Who is hungry? Me! Mm -hmm. Pablo, I know you'll be the first person to raise up your hand. I beg you, I beg you, I beg you. One after the other, okay? So, Dorothy, you are right. Not every parent deserves a child. Yes, but every child deserves a parent. Yes, you are right. And that is why you have me. You can confide in me. But, Dad, why is the world too wicked? Why can't they give the lonely children a home in the society? Like I said earlier, that is why you have me and we are family. No, it's okay. Stop crying. Like how you. You come on, come on. on your legs while seeing a movie? Huh? Leave my little angel alone. She has done nothing wrong. Where is Dorothy? Yes, Dad. Well, hey, shut up! I have told you times with that number that whenever you talk, don't open your trash called mouth to talk. 
Sorry. Sorry for your useless self. Nonsense. I just want to distract you from this little witch. <laughs> I'm okay, I'm fine. <laughs> oh, baby. I've been meaning to ask you the name we're going to call our child. Do you have one in mind? We should call her Dorothy. What? Yes. Dorothy has brought good fortune to us. What are you saying? I have brought good fortune to this girl. Have you forgotten that I picked her from the dustbin called the orphanage? I brought her to my house. I feed her. I clothe her. I am the one to be appreciated for changing her destiny. Ah? And you, what are you looking at? You motherless idiots. Huh? I'm sorry, Mom. You're sorry. Sorry for your fatherless and your motherless childhood. Nonsense. Will you get out from here? Smelly so idiots. Bella. Hmm. Bella. That's my name. You have Bella killed. What are you doing? This girl has done nothing wrong. I hope you know the repercussion of what you are doing. There is no repercussion to what I'm doing. I'm doing the right thing. I'm training this child to become better in the future. I've not started. I've not done anything to her. Once again, you had better change. You had better change! Dorothy! Dorothy! Hey! Can you imagine? This Dorothy wants to snatch my husband. He's taking the whole attention from me. Hey! Ah! Uh -huh. Oh! From that shambles you call home to steal my husband away from me. You came from the pit of hell, from that motherless home, that shambles you called home to steal my husband's attention from me. Look at my husband. He no longer gives me attention. Not just me, my daughter. He no longer gives us attention all because of you. Every time I, I, I passed, I did this, I passed my grade. Are you the only one? Let me tell you, very soon I'm going to have a daughter. My beautiful daughter is coming forth soon. And she is going to do better than you. Huh? Now look at my husband. He no longer gives me attention. All because of you. Huh? What is the meaning of this? What is the meaning of what? What is the meaning of what? But Mama, I was just showing that my results. 
How dare you talk when my husband and I are talking? Huh? 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 You have the nerve to talk back at me? Are you out of your mind? Hello, what are you doing on this? Are you okay? What is the thing? Next time you try this on my daughter, you you you, you will choke with you. Leave this out for loving her. What is wrong with you? I have warned you. Oh, because of this thing! This motherless thing! I, this orphanage thing! You slapped me! For what? I, 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 I won't warn you again. So the next time you try this on my daughter, is it that you shoot between loving her or loving yourself? You slapped me. Because of this commoner! Because of this fool, you slapped me! Your wife! Because of this motherless thing! This fatherless thing, you laid your hands on me. I won't warn you again. I won't warn you again. Hey! I'm finished. They want to steal my husband away from me. Hey! Hey! You don't believe me. You don't believe me. As you can see, I'm set to travel. Mm -hmm. Please remember all we discuss. Sure. Take care of the house, my little angel, of course. and Dorothy. Of course, darling. Yeah. Dorothy. Yes, Please be a good girl, okay? Dad, I will miss you. Can't I join you? No, you can't. I won't be staying for too long, okay? Okay, mm. Dad. But Dad, how many days will you stay there? I'm not staying for too long, like I said. Let's say in a week's time I'll be back. It's long, Dad. But I'll try to cook. Please do it. Too bad. I'll miss you. I'll miss you, Dad. Come, give Daddy a bed. Mm. Um, honey. Come on. Are you OK? 
Yes. I'm sorry. Yes. Come on, give me a call. Well, I have to go now. Alright. Would you girls see me off? Yeah, sure. Come here, my girl. Oh. I think I need to act fast and now that my husband has traveled. This girl is becoming a threat to my family. Just the other day, I got a slap because of her. Something my husband has never ever done before. He never gave me a peck. See me, me and Dorothy, who deserve a peck first? Huh? <laughs> It means this girl is taking my place and that of my child. Which I need to do something about it before it gets out of hand. Yes, I need to act fast before he returns. So what will I do? What will I do? What will I do? Should I poison her? Should I kill her? Should I send her away? Please direct me. Direct me. This girl needs to go back to the hell where she belongs to. She needs to go back to hell where she belongs. That reminds me. Yeah. Are you still going to travel? Yes, certainly. Uh. <laughs> I knew it. I knew. <laughs> what I do you know. expect from an international business lady like you? Uh, I know. <laughs> reminds me don't you think you're putting this little girl through so much for her age this is an obvious maltreatment I mean each time I come here she's either doing one thing or another do you even give her time to rest and when did you start taking Panadol for another person's headache I don't get this is an obvious maltreatment who told you that I am maltreating her? Bella, this is an obvious fact. And you know you can't deny it. I mean, there's a saying, tomorrow is pregnant. No one knows what it comes with. Enough! I mean, you have a baby. Enough, Stella, please. Sorry. As a matter of fact, you've overstayed your work. So please, 
Use the gates. What? Bella, are you asking me out of your house? I will do that over and over and over again. Asking me out of your house because I told you the truth? What truth? Huh? What truth are you talking about? Please, get out of my house. It's fine. <laughs> I'll leave, but be rest assured you will never see him here. As who? As Dangote? Huh? And again, I have a word for you. Take it easy on that poor girl. She doesn't deserve all this. I don't want to insult you. Get out! Get out. It's fine. Close the door behind you! Nonsense. Hey! Come back here! Why is this useless gate man? Wait! I'll so fire you! Go and come back! I'll so fire you! Who's left it for? Nonsense! I know. I just wanted to surprise you. You like my surprise, right? Yes, Mom. <laughs> First of all, you said you want to get provisions for you. Of course, I promise to get provisions for you, okay? okay. I have the provision. Let me get it for you. Pleasant surprise. Huh? We're not expecting you people. I know. How is your husband? Um, he's fine. He's actually waiting for me. Oh, look at you. I missed you. I missed you too, my I love. I love my new home. I love my new home. Really? My family are wonderful people. Ah, uh, I told you that you do surely come to us. Wow, what do you have? My mom gave this to me to share to my friends. She did? Yes. Wow, okay, come then, let's share it to them. <laughs> wow. Wow, can't you see that Dorothy brought good fortune to you? She came to your house with her good luck charm. You're not saying anything. Is anything the matter? Come, let's go and talk about it. Um, no need for that, madam. As you can see, I'm here to drop up the ratty. Yes. Just like the contrast stated that I can return her anytime if I don't need her. So right now, I don't need her anymore. Because I cannot tolerate a witch in my house. A witch? A little witch. How dare you call her a witch? No, 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 no. I won't take this. My girl is not a witch. Wait a minute. Is it because you now have your own child that you now decided to dump a girl that brought you good luck? Is it? Or is it something else you're not telling me? Bella. Oh, please, whatever. Ha! I don't have time for that. 
Let me get her bag for you. Her bag. Let me get you her bag. Huh. This is so unbelievable. What is that? Mean? Okay, um, for a witch. You know, these are bags. Witch? Yeah. You now call that a witch? Yeah. Hey! This is unbelievable. Eh? So this is it. She now dumps her because she, she now have her own child. She went to get more stuff for the kids. Mom has gone. Mom, here. She has brought you back. She says she doesn't want you again. It's on my bag. Maybe because she now has her own child. So she has brought you back to me. Who brought this? It's here? okay. This is also your mom. Let's go. Get, get your bag. Let's go in. Are you joking? She says she doesn't want you. Come, let's let's go inside. Carry your bag. No! Dorothy, I get to get to Dorothy, where, where are you going to? Come back, Dorothy. This is also your home. Come here. Dorothy. You can see a dodge jump person. What is your wicked driver? I don't tell you before. Let's let you drive. See, you don't keep person now for granted. Oh, go relax your living. I'll be your senior. Like you you know, I'm not saying I said I'm not trying this girl just now. Why you do like that? Senior matter. You don't keep person. I'm not going to be a more kind of the gospel. I'm not going to be a more kind of the gospel. I'm going to run if you want to go. I'm going to leave there and show you. Okay, now no shit. about it wherever she is she'll be fine okay i know that the good lord will guide and protect her wherever she is there is nothing there to bother about okay i know she's your very good friend i know you miss her a lot she'll be fine all right stand up all right yeah. 
This is your pain Don't be afraid to shine Cause you are a star Oh, you are a star You are a star My precious child You are a star to get killed in an accident. Tell me about yourself. Kid, don't you? I am an orphan. But luckily, I was born by heart to my new parents. But my doctor returned me to the orphanage where I was raised up. When I noticed I've been rejected, I was devastated and ran after my doctors. This is the result of an accident. <sighs> Your story is quite a pathetic one. Hmm. I'm sorry about all that, okay? Stella. Doc. Can you at least call her parents so they can come meet her up or perhaps any of our relations? Um, honestly, Doc, uh, the only person I'm in contact with is her mom. But sadly, we, we no longer talk, so I, I deleted her number. How about her father, I mean, her dad? I don't have it either. I have my dad's number. Oh, you do? Yes. Oh, very good. Uh, you just have to call me for me so I can call him right away, right? Alright, go on. So, seven, zero. Okay. Six, one. Six, one. Six, two. Six, two. Seven, seven. Seven, seven. Two, five. Two, five. Are you sure this is the correct number? This is Mr. Ben's number. You, is Mr. Ben your father? Yes. Oh my goodness. Hello, hello, Mr. Ben. Yes, it's, it's, it's me, Dr. Andre. How is everything? Okay, um, there's a situation I, I think I should know about. You see, um, your daughter, Dorothy is actually here at our hospital. Yes. She almost got knocked down by a vehicle and uh, it's actually a good Samaritan that brought her here by name Stella. Yes, you need to come immediately. Yes, I'll be waiting for you. All right then. He's coming. Is he on his way now? Yes, he's on his way. He's coming. You 
your life. But she's okay. Yes, she's completely fine. She's alright. I just have to attend to that patient, spend you when the mother comes. Okay. Thank you. Just Thank take care of her, okay? Thanks, man. I'm back. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank Yes, sir. Let's go, let's go. I just spoke to him and he said he was close to the hospital. How come he's not here yet? Let me try calling him again. No, please, I'm, I'm here to see my daughter. What's your daughter, sir? Her name is Dorothy. Oh, the little girl? Yes. The daughter should be with her right now. In there. Just go straight, the first word by your rights. Straight by my rights? Yes, sir. Thank you. Stella here. Thank you so much, Stella. You are indeed a wonderful person. It's alright, Mr. Bennett. Thank God. Thank you, Doctor. I mentioned. Yeah. But I hope it wasn't serious. Oh, not really. Um, you see, the, the car did not actually hit her. You know, she, according to the story Stella told me, she ran onto the road and then just as the car wants to hit her, she fainted. So she actually fell down and, you know, fainted as a result of fear. You know, but nothing, nothing really serious happened. She's fine. So can I, can I take her home now? Yeah, sure. You can. I mean, she's okay, like I said. As you can see, we have administered, you know, some drip and then a little bit of treatment on her. She, she's completely fine. She's okay. She can go home. But before that, Mr. Ben, we need to talk. I mean, there's something I really need to discuss with you. Please, let's go to my office. It's fine, Doctor. Right, let's go. Come here. Okay. Okay. You see, Mr. Ben, after proper examination on the girl, I discovered that she's actually going through a lot of emotional trauma, which should not be at her age. I mean, I wonder why she's going through such. Sometimes she loses concentration and then begins to imagine things and all of that. I feel psychologically she's not alright. That is why. I called you here so I can really find out from you. What is really the problem? I mean, why is that girl going through so much at her age? See, Doctor, I do not have a single idea of what you're talking about. I do not. Are you sure about this? Of course I'm sure. I mean, if I do, I will tell you. attention to the little girl. Whatever is the problem, try and fix it. She doesn't deserve to go through all that, you know, for her age. She's so young. So please, I beg you to take very good care of her. I will, Doctor. It's okay. 
and thank you for everything. And like you said, uh, I'll just stick up now. It's okay. Uh, like, uh, you know, I've actually done so much, you know, in making sure that she is alright. So you can take her home and um, make sure she's okay. Alright? Thank you so much, Dr. I really do appreciate it. You're welcome. You're welcome. Have a nice day. And you too. Says we can go home now. But where is Stella? She left. Why? Is she okay? I think she isn't happy with mom. Do you know why? No, Dad. Okay. Don't worry. I'll get the doctor to take this off your hands and go home. Yeah, but if you see what we're going home, that means we need to go to the orphanage home to pick my bag. And what is your bag doing there? Mom took me there and left me because my trying to run to her that the car almost knocked me. What? Yes, Dad. Are you serious? Okay, just hold on and get get to doctor, okay? I'll be right back. Let me take responsibilities for our actions. I am deeply sorry. And I promise this will never happen again. <sighs> Dora to hear. It's one of the most intelligent and well-behaved child in our home. It's only really nice that whoever adopts her treats her well. But it's quite unfortunate that your wife had to bring her back in your absence. All the same, I've heard what you said. Can go back with her. Thank you, my darling. I love you. I love you to my child. Hmm? So go get your back and go back with your daddy, okay? Thank you so much, Mom. I really appreciate this. Thank you for everything you've done for me. You're welcome. It's okay. Thank you so much, Mom. Thanks for being a good girl by the app, okay? Thank you. Thank you, Mom. You're welcome.
This little witch. Honey, I thought you said you were traveling. As Why did you bring this little witch? As you can see, my trip was aborted. Caught of you. Better listen. This little girl is our child the very moment we decided to go for adoption. And you should learn to treat her right. Ex! Else what? Huh? I was the one that suggested that we should adopt her in the first place. And I can still change my mind. As a matter of fact, I have changed my mind. I'm done with her. So please take her to the orphanage where she belongs to. Please. She doesn't belong here. You lied. You lied! See, we have signed it already. She is our child! She is not my child. See, this is my house. And let me tell you, we have signed it already. She is our child. Oh, I guess this is the same reason your friend Stella is angry with you. Perhaps. Anyway, darling. Let's go in. Go where? <laughs> go where? In my house? She's not going anywhere. She is not going anywhere. Not in my house. I'm done. I'm done with her. She's not going anywhere. Do not let me push you. Do not push let me push you. Push me. Push me. Push me. She's not going. You push me. You push me all because of her. <sighs> Why did you open the door for this witch? Why did you open the door for this little witch? Huh? Do you want to what? Put it in your ear like a mother. Why did you open the door? Listen, listen. Next time I see you open this door for this little witch, you go back to the orphanage. You go back to the orphanage. See what you open your ear like a mother. The doctor said you need enough first. So I want you to take your shower and then you rest. Okay, Dad. And one more thing. I want you to disregard whatever thing my wife is saying. She doesn't mean them. I am sure with time she will learn to love and treat you right. Okay, Dad. Thank you, Dad, for everything you've done for me. May the good Lord continue to bless and protect you. Amen. And bless you too. Amen. Yeah, I have to go now. See you later, okay? Okay. Dad, I want to ask you this major to apologize to you, especially making you about your trip, just to ensure I'm safe and alive. Thank you, Dad. Your life is worth more than any trip, okay? I come to think of it, I can go to any trip at any time. I'm so glad to have a caring dad as you are. And I'm so lucky to have a beautiful and intelligent daughter like you. Thank you, dad. I love you, dad.
Honey, I am really famished. Please get me something to eat. <laughs> Go tell your wife. I mean, your new wife to get you something to eat. And what are you talking about? You know exactly what I am talking about. Ben, how could you love a stranger more than your wife and your daughter? How could you channel your affection and love to that thing? Leaving your family alone. Honey, you are getting this all twisted. I mean, how could I love Dorothy more than my own wife and child? That's not possible. I am only showing this little girl some love and affection. And that is what we promised them at the orphanage. Honey, I am really hungry. Please, get me something to eat. And I still insist that you go meet your new wife to give you something to eat and not me. Don't tell me you are serious. Please. Please. Baby. Baby. Yes, I need you. Please. Babe, stop this now. Stop it. Stop it. You see, I, I cannot perform. My stomach is empty. Stop it. Is it because of the food? Yes. Yes, it is going to be food, yes. Baby, please, I'm sorry. Baby. Baby. Baby, try and understand me. I'm your wife. It's my right. Please. Let me make some milk for you to drink so that you have strength to perform. Please. It is you that will drink milk. It is you that will drink milk. I, I, am I a baby that will be drinking milk? Just for you to perform. Yeah. I don't want to perform. Just stop. See, see, I don't want to perform. I don't want to. See, just leave me. I don't want to perform. Leave me alone. Please. You're putting on good girls, God give you. Yeah? Just one of the two girls so that you have. So that please will talk to you. Ah, baby, you're putting on the bed. You put the bed. Please, baby. The duvet is too thick on your body. You know you're putting on a duvet already. Let me reduce the duvet. What is this now? So you're putting on duvet on your body. So I want to help you. I will leave it soon for you. What is this now? Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Just you, you, you refuse to give me food. Leave me alone. Just 
I don't want. Please. this place. I mean thoroughly. Okay? So I don't want to see stains everywhere. You see those dirty dirty things they used to do at the orphanage. This is not an orphanage home. It's not a motherless home. Are you hearing me? You should make sure you wash this place very very well. Huh? Let it be sparkling. Are you listening? No 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 you are not. You are not listening to me. I know you. You are not. Are you sure? Are you sure? <laughs> Listen very well. Let your ears be open. When you are done, go to my bedroom. Move everywhere. Dress my bed. Dress it. Let it be sparkling. Okay? And if you don't do it, you know what I can do to you. Sure, you know what I can do to you. Yes, ma'am. I'm not, I'm not sure you know. You know. So clean everywhere. Huh? And when I come back, I want everywhere to be neat. Okay, hey, start. Start. Start washing. Start washing. Don't just eat. Jesus. Are you doing here? Are you done with the chores I asked you to do? Yes, mom. You're done with everything, the clean and everything. Yes, mom. And what are you doing in my parlor? How many times have I told you not to touch my remote? How many times? Were you not supposed to beg the child? But mom, I didn't know how to do that. You don't know how to do that. You must learn how to do that one. You hear me? You cannot come here and eat my food and, and, and sit and sit lazy. You need to be busy. Stand up, eh? Go, go, go. Go and beat my child. Mom, I can't beat her. Come on. 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 Come on.
why do you say so? I don't know, I just think so. Why you talk so? It's true, I'm having the same feeling. You put them say that they see vision now. You put them say you be past a wife now. Pablo! Why do you say something like that? The daughter finished. Do you look, look me from head down? Do you think I'm past a wife? The daughter finished. You don't shout me. Yeah! Oh, voice. What is happening here? And why are you guys seated outside? I can't call fresh air. So, personal view, call fresh air again. Pablo. I never said it's time for fresh air, okay? Now stand up, let's go inside. I saw some flat class everywhere, person they go every day, say, still here, person see they were there, don't tie out. Pablo, Pablo, you better stop this stupid attitude of yours for you not to corrupt other children's mind. If you repeat this thing again, I will not think twice to report it to mom. What's all this? We never reach like that now. Why are you there? Free your mind, damn it, God. You, you, you already like found one more leg now. Show, tap on, tap on, you tap on, oh, boy, please. Calm down. Stand up, let's go inside. My child. You want to you want to bend my child's leg? You want her to have K leg? Be careful! You want her to have K leg? <sighs> wash wash the armpits the armpits wash the armpits. You want her to have armpit odor? You want her to smell like you? Wash it very well. What? Why is your face like that? Did I do anything wrong? I asked her to bathe the baby. She's an adult. She can't. Bella, what is wrong with you? How could you allow this little shy to bat our baby? What is wrong with me? What? What have I done? Bella! No problem. You are the man of the house. You call the shots. But she can't just stay in my house without doing anything. Okay? She can't just stay in my house, eat my food without doing anything. She has to work her ass out. So everything I give to her, she must do it. She can't lazy around in my house. Avoid the head! Avoid the head! Don't go and put shot my child's eye. Baby, be fast. And who are you leaving your child for? She has to bet the baby. You can as well join her to get the child. Well, don't worry, I'll take care of her. After all, I'm done beating her. I just left for the she brings her and wear her clothes. Are you sure? Yes, dog. Here. 
my throat is so funny that my name is not Dirty or Dirty. What's the difference? Oh. Dirty. Akala Dirty. That's your name. My friend, take this money to the market and get me vegetables, tomatoes, and spices. Okay? Take the money, go. But, Mom, I don't know the market. And besides, I haven't been there before. You and Dad has been the only one getting these tops for the house. Why send me now? Okay. That's a beautiful question. Hmm? I'm sending you now because from now on, you'll be the one getting stuffs from the markets. So I want you to go there and get acquainted with the markets. Have I answered your question? What if I get lost or kidnapped, perhaps? <laughs> Who will kidnap you? Like who know you? Do you know yourself? Do you do you know your mother? Or do you know your father? Hmm. And if you get kidnapped, it's none of my business. It's of no use to me. My friend, come and rush to the market and get me something. And make sure you don't stay more than 10 minutes. Rush, 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 go! My baby, it's a my love, my sweet. Not Dorothy. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Dorothy, what are you doing in the market? Mom sent me. Sent you what? Since she told me to die, she was keeping me alive. Let her touch you, my friend. Get in the car! Get inside! Get What is the meaning of this? Why would you send that little girl to the market to get stuff for you? What for? Hey! What is wrong with that? Can't I send her to the market to buy something for me? Now listen. Let this be the first and last time you send that girl out of this company to get stuff for you. Do I make myself clear? Did you just do that? Are you? Are you scolding me? What have I done wrong? Huh? I don't have the time right now. What is wrong with you? What has come over you? Are you scolding me? Hey! My child! Don't cry no more! You just say a prayer and hope for the best And God will see you true He knows your innocence He sees your pain Don't be afraid to shine The baby is crying The baby is crying and what do you want me to do? I think she's hungry. Come and breastfeed her. So you can't breastfeed a baby? Don't you have breasts? When I was your age, I used to breastfeed a baby. Hmm? We can't do any single thing in this house. When a baby is crying, what were you supposed to do? Can't you back her? 
Can't you make her to stop crying? I don't know how to do that. You don't know how to do that, but you know how to eat cereal. You know how to eat. You don't know how to use your brain. This is your dry brain. You don't know how to use it. You're disturbing me to come and breastfeed the baby. You don't know how to do any single thing in this house. Hmm? You don't know how to back. In fact, you're going to learn it in a hard way to go. You must learn it. Oh yeah, let's go. Follow me. Follow me. Oh, follow me. I'm going to have to back up. I'll back up. You don't have to back up. Baby. Turn your back. Let me teach you how to, to carry baby. Hold, hold, hold her. Hold her. Don't go for my baby. Don't tell me that baby will send you to come and kill my baby. I will kill your life. Keep your hands. My baby. My baby, relax, huh? Hmm? Turn your front. My love. Yeah. Put your hand inside, baby. Yeah, my love. Yes, that's my baby. Yeah. Okay. I will teach you how to carry baby in a hard way. I will teach you everything in a hard way. You must learn. You need to be strong. This country you need to be strong. My baby. Carry my baby very well. That's how you do it. My mother taught me how to do it when I was younger than your age. Huh? I learned how to carry baby when I was a child. Okay. Yeah, move, 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 move. Hey. Carry my baby very well. Okay. Get out from here. Get out! Jesus. Now be that. Now be that. Someone. Someone will be who? Come on, That's my people. I go front Go now. So now, baby, see that you can't do for me. I bet they're not the pay most more money for nanny work now. Ah, for this orphanage where you join. Shh! Pablo! Shut up your mouth! I'm going to give 20 years attachment to Pablo! Shut up! Good afternoon, man. So we came to, you know, actually visit her and to know how she's actually doing. Yes. Thank you so much. I missed you all. Uh, <laughs> that's my baby. I really miss you too. Will you shut up? I make sure I carry that baby very well. Okay? I don't want the baby to fall down now, you know? Just tell me that it's a liquid that sent you to come and kill my baby. Carry her very well! Nonsense. 
Yeah. Hey, madam, as you can see, yes. she's doing very well. I can see. Her color is glowy, right? Yes. She's feeding very well. Hmm? She's my child. Hmm? So this is not an orphanage home. Okay? Wow, be like If now so they won't go there, adopt me. I'll cook my remain orphanage. Pablo, can't you be responsible for just two minutes for crying out loud when in someone's house? And moreover, you're not orphanage. But orphanage, Pablo, we are orphanage. Shut up your teeth. Who call you? People they talk, they talk. They, they use grammar, they package your life, they package your destiny. Who send you? I'll be orphanage, you'll be orphanage. Everybody will call me Dora Queen, I'm orphanage. I'm not sending you that one. Either. I'm telling you something. Hey, 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 Orphans and orphanages, stop making noise. This is not an orphanage home. Get out of my house. Get out! This is not an orphanage home. Okay? But go, 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 go. At least let them come in. I'll offer them something to eat, at least. But then come in. You offer them something to eat. Like what? I don't have a jebugari in my house. This is not an orphanage home. Get out. Oh, yeah? What's your orphanage? I'm sorry. Yes. Sorry, ma. Get out! Go, go, go back to your orphanage. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. go, go. And now, listen. If I see them here again, if I see them here again, not at all, man. I will send you to orphanage home. Sorry, man. I will send you to orphanage home. Sorry, man. No sense. Look at your trousers. Sorry, Sorry, man. Man. Oh, yeah. Sorry, man. Why are you having this time? Go to the house. I'm going to poison my child. Where are you taking? Where are you taking? I will use that. No, I'm not coming here again, though. This is more work I use over now. This is this girl woman now. Attack me. No, I'm not coming here again, though. This is more work I use over body now. And I will do now. Tell woman now go to sack me. Just every time she just bah, 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 bah. sorry, sorry. Huh? My child, don't cry no more. You just say a prayer and hope for the best, and God will see you through. My darling daughter. You look rather worried. And you are crying. What is it? It's not in dead. I'm fine. Don't even try to cover this up. Tell me, what has Bella done to you again? I'm not in dead. I'm fine. You know, I won't know what happened if you don't tell me. And of course, you know, Bella would not tell me. So, my dear, tell me what happened why I was at work. So, talk to me. What happened? My first family came visiting me today. And mom sent them away out of the gates. She didn't even allow me to give them this little water for them to drink. She sent them away out of the gate. This is so ridiculous. Why is Bella suddenly treating people this way? You know what? I am truly sorry for her actions. It's fine, Dad. And as for your friends, I will make you love to them. I shall send for them next week, host a party for them, for them to eat and drink whatever thing they want. Peter. Is that okay with you? Yes, Dad. And smile for Daddy. Come on, smile for Daddy. I'll go fetch him up now. Peter. I'll see you later. Okay? okay? Yes, Dad. Mom, when are you coming back? In two days' time. Mom, 
come please with the kind of situation on board right now i think you have to come back very fast if it is possible today the reason is because dora is really suffering dora is suffering in her new home this mom mom can you imagine i am pablo going to visit her in her new home this woman couldn't even bring us in into her home Talk more of keeping us water to drink. Yes, mom, the, the truth is that even when we went there, the girl is she's losing strength. I don't think she even eats at all. And she's even carrying a child at her back. Okay, mom. The others, they're fine. They're okay. They're eating. Yes, mom. Okay, mom. No problem. Oh, please come back, please. You really need to see her. Okay. Where are you going with your bag? Dad, I'm leaving. This is not the type of life I want to live. Mom hates me for no reason. She makes me do things an adult wouldn't do. You're a good man, Dad. But the truth is, I don't want to die. So let me go to a place and sin and, and love. And as for you, Mom, I loved you. Like every child who loved them more. But I got the, re the reverse from you. And I pray that your offspring wouldn't go through half of what I've been through at my age. Even if I don't have a home, you will have. Even if I walk on the streets, this has a place to call my home. Your offspring will never roam on the streets. This is my life and my fate. And I guess I will face it alone, like I've always done before you came into my life. And I know someday a mother who will love and treat me well shall come for me. I still love you, Dad. You remain the best dad in my heart. I love you, Dad. Thank you, Danny. How are you? We have everything that has been happening to you. That is why we are here to take you home. Okay? Mm -hmm. Let's go. Oh, please. Please, Ma. It, it hasn't caught up to this. Mr. Ben, it has. It has gotten to this. Look at you. 
both of you came for this child. And I gladly gave her to you. Because you promised to take care of her and to love her like your own. But the reverse here is the case. Dorothy here might be an orphan. But she also deserves to live a good life like the other children out there. I cannot sit back and watch her suffer. So I'm here to take her home to go meet the other kids. Don't go, please. Dorothy. I am speechless. I don't know what to say. Dorothy has never wronged me. As a matter of fact, she is a good kid. I don't know what came over me. I don't know. I don't know what came over me. I treated her wrongly. I did a lot to you, Dorothy. I don't deserve your mercy. I don't deserve your mercy. For everything I've treated you. You still remain patient. Your patience was impeccable. You were a wonderful kid, Dorothy. You were a kid that every woman will be proud of, every mother. And I know someday you were in the best position to teach my child your kind of lifestyle. I admire your patient, Dorothy. I am ashamed of myself. <laughs> I am ashamed of myself. I don't deserve you. <laughs> Dorothy, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry for wronging you. <laughs> Shout out the universe. 
she 